Hi, and welcome to my tutorial on Euclid's Elements, Book 8. In this tutorial, we'll be working on Proposition 16. Now, this proposition states that if you have two square numbers, in other words, a is equal to c squared and b is equal to d squared, so c and d are referred to as sides, then if a does not measure b, then c does not measure d. The inverse of this, again, we have our two square numbers. If c does not measure d, then a do does not measure b. So we are going to prove this by contradiction. So we're starting with the first part of this proposition, which says that if a measures b, or if a does not measure b, c does not measure d. So we're going to, because we're doing it by contradiction, we're going to assume that c measures d. Now in proposition 14, we said that, or we demonstrated that if c measures d, then a measures b. But we're, our original assumption is that a does not measure b, so therefore c does not measure d. That's the first part of the proof. The second part, we have that if C does not measure D, then A does not measure B. We're going to demonstrate this again by contradiction. So we're going to assume that A measures B. But again from Proposition 14, if A measures B, then C measures D. But we've stated that C does not measure D. So therefore, A does not measure D. And that is the proof of the second part of this proposition. 